Halfway around. <laughs> Brad's getting hydrated. <laughs> yeah. All right. I need a peach tea from Joffrey's. Something I haven't had in a while was a turkey leg. That is true. Long time. Show right here. Turkey leg. And now we have Spain. A seafood salad. Scallops, shrimp, mussels. Are you going to get it? Paprika. Oh, that does look good. Okay, I'll get you one. Whoop, whoop. I'm waiting in the line for Brad. Why do I have to do this? Because I love him. <laughs> oh, you're going to come wait with me? You're welcome. You're welcome. You're welcome. Seafood salad. Hi. Seafood salad? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Is it good though? Let me see it. Probably should have got the other thing. Germany! Sure. Brad said he wants to get some popcorn to take home and I said sure. And who's going to get it again? <laughs> Just kidding. He's eating right now so I don't mind. It's all about being wonderful to each other. Just smelling this. I wish I could take the smell home. So we just got some popcorn in Germany to take home. How is your seafood salad? Um, it should be more... It should be more chilled if it's going to be cold. Oh. Um. Okay, so... and. It should have more, um, it should actually, when it's cold like that, be spicy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm running across a lot of bland food and I get it. You're trying to make it more appetizing to the mass. Mm -hmm. But that's just like when you uh, change the menu at uh, Skipper Canteen. Uh -huh. India, Brad was excited about curry, but he doesn't want to wait in the line. It does smell good though. Mm. Oh. I guess probably go get one of my normal drinks. We got our lychee water and there's a nice breeze going. Did you just cut that out? <laughs> yep. What is wrong with you? <laughs> there's a nice breeze going. Because there's a storm rolling in. See those clouds over there? And over here. <laughs> China! We made it all the way around the world. We're just leaving Mexico. Si, senorita. Out in front of Test Track, there is Taste Track, and they have special croissant donuts. So there's four different kinds. There's one with cinnamon sugar, which is the normal, chocolate and marshmallows, with sprinkles and chocolate hazelnut cream. Just walked from over there, Taste Track. Again, right out in front of Test Track. And we decided to get the croissant donut with sprinkles. So basically the same thing without all like the cinnamon and sugar. But it looks delicious. You guys see all those flakes in there? It just oh, looks so amazing. Look at that one sprinkle. It's like sticking straight up. <laughs> Alright, ready to try this? Hello, ready to try this? Yeah, thanks. <laughs> Um, chewy. Is it? Is it good? Yeah. No. Oh. <laughs> Enjoy it. Oh no. Oh no. It's definitely better to wait until the afternoon on the first day because this time it was a lot busier this morning than it was last year. And now we're getting in line. Woohoo! I don't even think there is a line, is there? 
This was all a line last time. Just a little bit one. Just a little, not so bad. We just got our magnet. Yay! As you pass the fountain on the way in, it's also on the way out. And that's what we're doing, we're walking out. Quick little morning, afternoon trip to Epcot, right? Yay! I forgot to show, this is the maps for this year. And well, we got some goodies. You got your shirt. I got I a did. magnet. You got a new car. I mean, it all worked out for all of us, right? <laughs> oh, funny. Our first time going on Spaceship Earth since it no longer says Siemens. Crazy, crazy, crazy. I think it's been down for a little bit, but we just never noticed it the last time. It's funny, it still said Siemens on here. <laughs> Please remain seated, time travelers. Attention travelers, please remain seated. Your time machine is rotating backward for your return to Earth. We're headed out and heading home. Great early morning, afternoon here at Alcott. To be able to come to Food and Wine for the first time. Well, not for the first time, but for day one, I should say. But here's the cute stuff when you walk out. Thank you for celebrating with us. And yes, Brad's going to get his peach tea on the way out, right? No? Yes? Oh. <laughs> Bye, thank you. <laughs> Your peach tea? Yes, he did. And there's a closer view of Guardians of the Galaxy. After all the times I got you food today. <laughs> Love you too, babe. We're almost home and I forgot to end the vlog. Uh, and? and um, we left just in time before the rain started coming down. Not too bad, just drizzling a little bit like it was this morning or early afternoon. But we are heading home. We just were there for a quick morning, early afternoon to go to day one of Food and Wine Festival for 2018. Did you have fun? 74 more days to go. Uh -huh. Okay. What was your favorite food of the day? Um, sorry, watching the accidents on 75. What was your favorite food of the day? Um, I don't know, nothing really stood out. I guess, wait, what's going on there? Man. Hawaii? Uh, what did I have from there? The, the pork slider and the hash? Yeah, uh, Spam. The Spam and potatoes was pretty good. Uh, needs to be a little more crispier, but, uh, I don't know, I think everything could have been a little bit better. <laughs> Peach tea's good. It's always good. Oh yeah, I forgot to tell you guys how the croissant donut was. So, um, yeah, it was chewy. Really, it was chewy and it was really oily. Like literally, like you could see it on your hands. You had to kind of pull so, it apart. Yeah, it was really 
like food. You had to go like, like this. Like it wasn't like gross in the sense that you couldn't eat it, but like it was gross in the sense that it was messy. I'm sorry. And hard. It was hard. And like literally the best way for me to eat it was to peel it by layer. I should have showed you. No, that's no fun. Yeah, that wasn't very fun. Never but I fun. Literally peeled the top layer off, which had all like the sprinkles and stuff on it, and like had to fold it in half, like you do like a pizza sometimes. It was really strange, but I think because they're not as fresh over at Refreshment Port, I think because it was cold, it just started getting really hard, and then like all the oil sort of just like went to the bottom or something. I don't know. Yeah, sorry, I'm trying to dodge all these accidents. <laughs> after accidents after accidents everywhere but yeah i mean i think it would have been really good if it was fresh because then it would have been so chewy right? it's first day i don't know why they weren't fresh well i think it's because they don't have a fryer there probably at that little sand and they I probably guess. just do them like pre-made or something. oh we the i know what my favorite food was what come on what the what i'll give you a hint a Brisket poutine from the uh, refreshment port. Fresh cock. Yeah. Freshman uh, yeah. port. Freshman port. But yes, they're good. Get the brisk poutine. Yeah. It was good. The cheese yeah. and the chunks of brisket. Yeah, there was a lot. Yeah. yeah. But the fries, they need to change them out to be like the one at Disney Springs. Mm -hmm. So, but we had a nice day. We got to see a lot of you guys. So, so nice to meet y'all. Um, and I hope you guys enjoy the rest of your trip and safe travels home for everyone. So, see you next time. Bye, guys. You guys say bye? Peace! Oh, bye. See you. <laughs>